Hey, my loves. So today I'm going to be reacting to Bill Burr, Prius, Kids, and whatever else it says. Shout out to Peep the Frog and Alan for requesting this video. I think I'll be a good dad, though. You know, I do. <laughs> no, analyze it. I don't. I've actually finally come to the point. I want to have a kid, and I don't think it's that hard. I don't. Part of me really believes that. And the other part is I just like pissing off people with kids, you know? <laughs> yeah, that's you exactly like what it does. Oh, you have no idea how difficult it is. This is a great one to say. Well, I mean, I got a dog. I mean, you know, how much stuff? Dude, you can't even fucking compare it to a dog. That's yeah, what I, I do with my cat. Did, that's my son. Mine's got four legs. Yours only has two. Go ahead. <laughs> right. Yours bites someone and gets a timeout. Mine gets put down. Ooh. Stakes are raised. No, I think I know. I think I know how to raise a kid. You know what it is? You just you just play catch with them. I think that's the big deal, man. That's how you raise a kid. You play catch with them. <laughs> is you that just how talk it works? About life. And you distract them by throwing the ball. They don't even notice you're filling their heads up with your theories. <laughs> right? <laughs> you don't do it the old school way, the way your parents used to. Sit down across from you. You want to tell me about your day? Did anybody offer you any drugs? <laughs> you learning about sex? You're like, dude, you're fucking freaking me out. I need a pop tart here, right? <laughs> pop tart. Like just taking the back, you play catch with them. That's it. You talk about life, right? What's that, son? Ah, we're not going to church today. Fuck that. Yeah. Ah, it's all a bunch of bullshit. God's everywhere, but I gotta go down there to see him, really? And he's mad at me down there, and I owe you money. Go fuck yourself. Nah, I can't relate. It's ridiculous. It's in here. It's not down, it's in here. They try to take it. It's down, it's in here. You do something good, you feel good. You do something bad, you feel bad, you know? Unless you're like a sociopath and you don't feel shit. You know? Dexter? Unless you got somebody duct taped upside down in your apartment, you know? And, and if you do something like that, I want you to feel like you can come to me, you know? Yeah, come to me, confess all of that. We'll go down to the precinct, we'll tell them everything. We'll I'm tell them everything. I'm gonna turn you in. This isn't fucking Dexter. What are you, your mind? Hey, that's what I said. Some feel good serial killer walking around. He only kills the, the bad people. <laughs> wow, that's actually a smart idea to do with kids. Your mother and I, we've been arguing a lot lately, all right? But I know, you know, you know I love her. I love her to death, okay? It's weird. I love her to death, but when I watch her eat toast, I just wanna, I just wanna choke her. I don't know what, what it is. It's, like, it's the routine, right? Left, then the middle. Just, why don't you just fold it in half and fucking eat it? You know what I mean? It's unreal. You know? That's, that, that's when you know, you, you know, you met the right one. When you want to slap the shit out of him, but you don't. You know? You want to leave, but you don't. There's something about him. You just can't fucking leave. Right? So don't settle down till you meet one like that. That's, that's when you know. Oh, gosh, Until no. Then, you know, put a condom on, you know? Bang as many as you can so you don't have a midlife crisis. That's what you do. Don't tell your mother I'm telling you any of this shit. Either. Is that what you do? Wow, okay. <laughs> yeah. That's my, uh, that's, that's my game plan. All right, not bad, not bad. It'll work. You know, I do have a dog. Do you have a boy? It doesn't count for anything. I've never understood that. You know, I love my dog, but, uh, I've learned a lot of being a dog owner, man. You know, any dog's a good dog unless you're a psycho. <laughs> you know, I got a pit bull. It's still a great dog unless you're a fucking psycho. And evidently, I'm a oh, psycho pit. because my dog has been up just been a complete maniac over the last like six months. You know, I didn't realize that dogs feed off your vibes. You know, like if you're chilling, they're chilling. You know, if you're sleeping, they're sleeping. But if you're a psycho like me and you're screaming at the ref on TV being like, dude, you got to be fucking kidding me. <laughs> I didn't realize the dog was over in the corner being like, yeah, you got to be fucking kidding me. <laughs> this is bullshit. I don't know what this guy's mad at, but I love this guy. This guy feeds me. He's in the door. Are me. you mad at the door? <laughs> yeah, I had no idea I was amping this dog up. I was so selfishly in my own world. I'd be like on the computer and would crash and go, oh, really? Really? Dog's over in the corner with like a chew toy. <laughs> I never noticed like that game seven look she was getting on her face. And one day I amped her up too much, had no clue. And I went outside. We were just walking down the street and some poor bastard comes the other way. And the dog's like, that's that motherfucker. 
around my own dog i started thinking fuck are pit bulls really like this do they just go psycho man this is nuts right that's another bad vibe to have around your dog because they pick up on that vibe right this dude comes walking down the street and i immediately just start thinking like oh shit she gonna do it again oh shit oh shit dog just looks at me like oh shit what oh shit what him him, him. <laughs> <laughs> that's really how dogs act though i'm sorry looking down at the dog dog's trying to chest bump me and shit right <laughs> chest bump Dude, it got so bad one day, she almost, she almost ate a landscaper, right? Yeah, so I'm like, I gotta, I gotta take this thing to a trainer, man. So I load it up in the Prius, and I drive over there, right? Yeah, I have a Prius. Go ahead, judge me. I love that shit. If you have a Prius, people, you know, you can't win. You got a truck with a big lift kit, people, oh, it's probably because he has a little dick. <laughs> right? I never he has said that. Dick down to the floor. Maybe that's why he needs all that clearance, right? You know, if that means you have a little dick, then if, if I have a Prius, doesn't that mean I, I have a huge dick, right? Because according to my friends, it means I'm a fag, right? Anyways. <laughs> Anyways is right. <laughs> Let me towel off here for a moment. So I fucking take this dog down to this trainer, right? And I show up, got the dog in the back. The trainer comes out, he's got his hat on backwards, he got stubble, you know, big, large cargo pants, you know all shorts on and stuff and i'm thinking this guy's a psycho right and i look at my dog my dog's like sizing him up i'm like this is perfect he can handle him so the guy goes all right when you hand this dog to me make sure you got the leash totally taut like that all right don't have any slack in it i said no problem right and somehow i fucked up i left a little slack in it and this dog just lunged right at the dude's balls all right and just barely missed him and just got a big mouthful of his big cargo shorts right and immediately just grabbed him goes all right get out of here get out of here right but instinctually i tried to help out and he just goes get the fuck out of here <laughs> Yeah, I didn't realize that the only reason why the dog was acting like that was because I was there and it felt like it needed to protect me. So the Aww. second I left, the situation immediately just became awkward, right? The dog was just sitting there like, okay, like, I thought we were, like, together and we were, like, <laughs> friends and you were some bad guy and all of a sudden he just drove away and I don't know how to feed myself. You want to be friends? <laughs> <laughs> want to be friends? Yeah, I come back four days later, the dog's laying at the guy's feet, right? He's rubbing her belly. She's reaching up, playing with his goatee and shit. And he goes, go ahead, ha have, a, have a seat. Why don't you, uh, why don't you uh, take me through your day with this dog? Immediately, I started getting like this first 48 vibe, right? Right. Like they're coming good. at me. So I got like defensive. I'm like, what do you mean? I take it for a hike every morning. He goes, that's good. That's good. Anything, you know, special happen on the hike? I'm like, well, you know, I don't know. She takes a shit. I pick it up. It's like, all right, easy. <laughs> <laughs> you play any games with her? I go, yeah, at the end of the hike. I let her, I let her, you know, for reward for going on the hike, I let her run up the stairs by herself. I go, go on, Cleo. I let her run up the stairs, and I count five, one thousand, and then I run up there, and then we start wrestling. Put her in a headlock, sweep her front legs, nah, <laughs> right? But her tail's wagging, you know? She's not growling. I go, that's a good thing, right? He's like, no, it's fucking horrible. What? I'm like, why? He goes, you just taught your dog to claim the house and then fight for it every fucking day after the hike. Good point. <laughs> no wonder this thing's trying to attack the mailman, you know? So then I got upset. I'm like, wait a minute, dude. You're telling me, like, I can't even play with my dog? He's like, no, you can play with it, but you got to bring that energy back down. Problem is, is you keep amping this thing up, getting that Mike Singletary look on his face. And by the time you walk out, doesn't matter if you're relaxed. Mentally, the dog is like walking through the tunnel at the Rose Bowl, like, this is what we play for. <laughs> somebody hit somebody. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm actually learning to control my temper because of a fucking pit bull. Okay. So, I don't know. My girls. That's it? All right, guys. I really hope you can hear me better. I'm really trying to work on the app on my phone so that you guys can hear me and I can also hear it at the same time. So, give me a thumbs up and comment down below. Love you guys. And also, don't forget to request what video you'd like to see next.